today. Most of our personal data and financial information is stored and managed by third parties. But this approach has several vulnerabilities. Ethereum aims to eliminate these vulnerabilities using blockchain. Ethereum is a platform based on blockchain technology that enables developers to build and deploy applications without any central authority. Ethereum aims to create censorship resistant, hack proof and decentralized network. Bitcoin and Ethereum are similar in many ways but has key differences. Blocks are the main building blocks of a blockchain. Ethereum block consists of a header and contained. Contained has a list of transactions and a list of hashes referencing to uncle blocks. Smart contracts are called through transactions sent to them by either an external account or another smart contract. The code in the smart contract is executed when a miner validates the transaction to which the smart contract is associated so that a new block is generated for this the miner charges a fee. In Ethereum, transactions and accounts are frequently created and each transaction created requires the balance of accounts to be updated. Therefore, Ethereum maintains a tree data structure which enables easy update, edit or delete operation. In total, there are three trees in Ethereum. First, world state tree. Second, transaction tree. Third, transaction receive tree. Ethereum client provides an interface to create transactions, mine blocks and various other blockchain interactions. Currently, three client implementations are available for Ethereum. First, ETH C++ client. Second, GET written in Go language. Third, PI ETH app, Python client for Ethereum. Mining is the process of creating blocks of transactions into Ethereum blockchain and getting rewarded with newly created Ether. A smart contract is pre-written logic stored and replicated on blockchain. This logic is executed and run by a network of computers running the blockchain. The key distinction between a smart contract and any other kind of agreement is that a smart contract doesn't just record the terms of a deal, it automates the deal execution based on contract parameters and verification can be carried out in real time. Advantages of smart contract driven services First, secures data storage. Second, privacy. Third, transparency. Fourth, disintermediation. The most popular programming language used currently to write smart contracts is Solidity. Solidity is an object-oriented, high-level programming language. Solidity is currently used as the primary language on Ethereum as well as on other private blockchains running on platforms that compete with Ethereum. The first thing you need to know is that you can create variables to store values in. You have to declare the name of each variable and its type before you try doing anything with it. Functions are the executable units of code within a contract. Given is a sample function bid defined in a contract. Say simple. In this line, we define the function and name it bid. 
Nothing else is known about the function as of now. The visibility of a state variable or a function defines who can see it. There are four kinds of visibilities for functions and state variables. First, external. Second, public. Third, internal. And fourth, private. Modifiers let us wrap additional functionality to a method similar in terms to decorator pattern. Decorator design pattern is used to enhance the functionality of a particular object at runtime. Modifiers are typically used in smart contracts to make sure that certain conditions are met before we proceed with executing rest of the body of code in the method. A contract in the sense of solidity is a collection of code that is its function and data that is its state that resides at a specific address on the ethereum blockchain. Contracts in solidity are similar to classes in object oriented languages. Solidity is a high level language used to code smart contracts on the Ethereum platform. Therefore, code written in Solidity requires a compiler to convert it into bytecode format which the EVM can interpret. There are several methods to compile smart contracts. Everything we do on the Ethereum blockchain happens at the level of GET which is a command line level interface on GET console. We do not expect an end user to be typing commands on some terminal for every small thing that he does on Ethereum. Web3.js is a collection of libraries which allows us to interact with a local or remote Ethereum node using HTTP or IPC connection. When running functions in smart contracts, we would at some point in time require the retrieval of values from the blockchain and bring it to the front-end UI. Some good programming practices in Solidity include avoid external calls when possible. Using some address.transfer is considered safe against re-entry while some address.call.value is not. Contracts should be deployed with the same compiler version and flags that they have been tested the most with. Don't assume contracts are created with zero balance. Avoid division by zero. Lock pragmas to specific compiler version. Even though it's amazing that the code remains immutable and immortal, the need to update the logic with time is absolutely necessary for developers. One method to resolve this is to isolate your logic from rest of your code. You could then have an entryway contract that can dynamically load logic from a different address at runtime via call code or delegate call. Smart contracts stored computational logic, data and perform automatic execution based on the data. The limitation with smart contracts is that they cannot access external data which might be required to control the execution of business logic. This is where an oracle comes to rescue. Oracle an oracle in the context of blockchain is a third party service that delivers data from an external source to smart contract. The 1 MB size limit per block is for Bitcoin blockchain. In Ethereum, there is a theoretical known limit for block size. However, Blockchain is not meant for data storage and storing large documents 
will be very expensive. That being said, many blockchain like solution design just to store data were developed recently. Some common ones are Storej, Filecoin, IPFS, etc.